team has its first ever bout coming up. Ladies Nine's Josh Gant has more on these dirty ladies and why they love the sport so much. Some are teachers, others nurses, and some even work in the corporate world. Five, one more. But when they strap on their helmets, pads, lace, and skates, it's roller derby time. Machete, jabber jock, let's see, boxy balboa, and a handful of others make up the revolution roller derby league, which formed about a year ago. But recently, the women decided to join forces and form the team, the Rolling Valkyries. We caught up with them during a recent practice at Silly Nations in Port Ritchie. Since the team is fairly new, the rep known as Craft Control starts every practice with an overview of the rules, disengage wherever they are. Five people make up the team, which includes jammers and blockers. As you can imagine, the roller derby is a sport that leaves people with a few bumps and bruises. But that's the best part if you ask any of these derby gals. Melissa Hughes, a.k.a. Deadly Dexter, says the Derby is a break from reality. She's a teacher during the day. Well, I think what sets roller derby apart from the rest of sports is, first of all, it's an all-women's sport, and second of all, you get the hip women and your fishnets while doing it. <laughs> We're told the Derby is steadily rolling to a comeback here in the Bay Area, and more women are getting involved. Roxanne Bensley says she hit a rough patch in life, and it got to her a lot. But that's really not the case anymore after she became Roxy Balboa. This is an outlet for, you know, all of those things that you want to do but you can't do. You know, you can let out your aggression here. And it's actually good there. It's great therapy. And it's helping to empower these women in more ways than one. It was a completely different thing away from the circle that I had been used to being in. And it's, I can't wait for practice. Hey, look, there's me in the background. Oh, mm -hmm. Rolling on special assignments.